when you're out in the heat out west somewhere it's not the time to find that um, your batteries in your caravan of cactus and um, in this episode we're going to have a look at um, AGM batteries and obviously uh, upgrading to lithium so hopefully this is uh, informative lithium today. I popped over here to have a look at uh, Andrew's Scout 15. He's done a pretty impressive uh, lithium upgrade on his van so we'll pop in there and have a look. Okay I'm talking to Andrew Holmes at Custom Lithium today and we're in his Scout 15. Um, looks like you've done a pretty impressive job here uh, Andrew. Why don't you uh, tell us just exactly what you've done. So we've upgraded the uh, the battery system straight away from factory, uh, ripped out the original AGM's charger system, replaced it with a 400 amp hour lithium battery uh, that we hand build here in Brisbane. Um, we've actually replaced all the charging units with a Victron setup uh, and wired the 240 volt for off grid with the multi plus inverter. Um, the guys also went a little bit uh, trigger happy with the credit card, upgraded the speaker system uh, with the radio, added a little subwoofer, that sort of stuff as well, so it'll look really good at the show. Um, but essentially what you do is um, battery systems, electrical systems, uh, DC to DC, solar, that sort of 100%, thing, yeah, that's so. the core of your business? Yep, so the battery is the core. We build the batteries and we ship them all across Australia. Uh, and then as, as a side to that, we actually do the full installations. So we install them uh, into caravans as a drive in, drive out, one sort of stop solution. Um, so that includes rewiring the whole van to be off-grid. So Andrew, I'm looking at these batteries here and they're um, all kinds of sizes. They're, what are they, custom-made sizes? So these are all hand-built here in Brendale. Uh, all of the different sizes are cut, are designed, cut and folded here. Uh, and then the internals are assembled here as well. So we actually take different uh, commonly used sizes uh, that suit different vehicles or caravans and we actually turn that into a product. So if I brought a caravan over or a car over and just a standard battery wouldn't fit, you can basically fold up one that will fit. Yeah, absolutely. So we do a custom design uh, process where our team will take the measurements. They'll actually do 3D CAD drawings uh, to work out what size uh, capacity battery will fit in the, in the measurements provided. Uh, and then we'll go forward and actually turn that into a product. What are we looking at here? So this is a testing station, so every battery that gets hand assembled goes through a testing process. It's pretty rigorous, so quality control. There's a lot of aspects of safety that you need to consider with lithium batteries, obviously. So uh, every battery will go across the testing bench, it'll get a charge, it'll get a discharge test. And each, each part of the battery will actually get tested for uh, resistance, heat, and anything that could go wrong before it gets cleared and shipped out to customers. We also have a blur camera floating around somewhere. So every battery we can actually hold the blur camera up and see the heat signature within the entire battery. So you, when you add 980 watts of solar, I imagine you also have to um, upgrade either the DC to DC charger with the solar input or the MPPT. That's right, yeah. Input. So, so with this model with the Victron upgrade, the DC DC and the MPPT are separate units. Um, so you've got the DC-DC charger here, which is a 30 amp charger. That's wired to an Anderson plug on the front of the van. And then underneath here, you've actually got quite a considerably sized uh, MPPT solar controller. That's a 150 slash 85. So we can get around 80 amps of solar in off the roof at the moment on a good day. So um, what's that, a thousand watt input? 980 watts, yeah. So uh, Well, that's the capacity of your panels, but what's the capacity of the input of the MPPT? So it'd be 150 volts slash 85 amp. Yeah. Right. Okay, and what size battery have you got in there? That's a 400 amp hour. And we could have easily fit the uh, 560 amp hour model. So with this installation, Andrew, with 400 amp hours of lithium, I imagine you can run your aircon. Yep, so we can flick the 240 volt on using the screen uh, and that'll enable the 240 across the van. So any of the original plugs will work 
and we can also just use the remote to turn the air conditioner on. And you said that uh, you've got Bluetooth, Bluetooth control, yeah? Yep, so from my phone here I can uh, I can control all of the circuit breakers in the van. I can enable or disable the lights, for example. Uh, I can turn on and off the radio. All of the useful things that you do on a day-to-day -day basis. Right, we could be running the aircon in here today. I'm sweating. Yeah, I think here. we need it, yeah. yeah. <laughs>